Last week, season two of The Four kicked off with a night of epic battles. The game is about to change on another level. I'll take you to turn. I know you will! James Graham and Stephanie Zelaya protected their seats. That feels amazing. This show is intense. While Carvina Jones was overthrown. Whatever your path is, you walk it with pride. Majesty, please go take your seat on the four. Now, these are the four to beat. Majesty Pearson. I'm so determined. I'm not ready to go in no way, shape, or form. James Graham. Challenge, just bring it on because it's going to take a lot to knock me off that seat. Stephanie Zelaya. This Latin little girl. I'm not afraid for any challenger. And Sharia J. I'm excited to get busy and get some battling done. <laughs> Hoping to battle the four is a new group of challengers who must first impress our panel of music experts. Mega producer DJ Khaled, Grammy Award winner Megan Trainer, and music icon Sean Diddy Combs. You gotta get into this game and make some noise. Tonight, no seat is safe as the competition heats up. She looked like a snack. I came here to eat. Are you ready to battle? I could show her better than I could tell her. If she don't win, I'm out. Little change of pace. Cool. It's a little sexy spooky going on. I'm, I'm very confused. If you challenge any of those four, you better want to smoke. stardom. Four artists are back to defend their seats. Majesty Pearson, James Graham, Stephanie Zelaya, and Sharia J. Please welcome the four. Let's talk about Do the feeling haunt you? Yeah. I know the feeling haunts you. This may be the night that my tears might let me know all the stars approach you. All the stars approach you. All the stars. This may be the night that my tears might let me know all the stars approach challenge these four is our panel of experts. Diddy. Yeah. It's season two. What do you think of the talent in those seats so far? I'm very impressed by the talent that we have. Are y'all ready to defend those chairs? Yeah. 
Each week, the four have to bring it on this stage to hold onto their seat. The longer they stay, the more they get a taste of what it's like to be a star. Check out what happened when they went backstage at the iHeartRadio Wango Tango event. I'm so excited to call myself one of the four. This is crazy amazing. Four. We're getting VIP treatment to this amazing concert, iHeartRadio's Wango Tango. We get the real VIP experience, like we're walking down the red carpet with all the cameras and the interviews. Felt like a real celeb. Sherea couldn't be here with us because she's actually back having her cancer treatment. I can't imagine what that would be like. But we know she's here with us in spirit. It's crazy to be able to chat with Megan Trainer right before she jumps out on stage. We're about to meet those Backstreet Boys. Yeah, oh, yeah nice. it's so good to meet you. What is your guys' favorite song of yours? Actually, my favorite song is our single. Yeah. Don't go breaking my heart. Yeah. Yeah. It was like ultimate fanboy moment for me. I am freaking out. Seeing the audience makes me want to fight harder on this competition. How are we feeling? Seeing the artist up on stage, I was like, that right there is literally, that's what I want to do for the rest of my life. That's going to be us up there one day. Hello. I know the other guys want it bad, but times that by 100, and that's me. Give it up for our VIPs. Hey. Sharia. I know your week was a little different. You had to fly home for cancer treatment. How was that? How are you? I'm doing good today. It was intense because I had to fly back to Atlanta and then turn right back around and come back here and be ready for a rehearsal the next day. But my booze right here called me on FaceTime just to show me some love while I was in the room recovering. So that was just all love. I, I really appreciate that for sure. Beautiful. Are you ready to get things going tonight? Let's bring out.